Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to remove video and just keep the audio for a podcast task. So firstly, what I've done is opened up the SD card and located my files. I ordinarily uh, go to date modified order and just select the most recent date. So what I've done is dragged and selected uh, all of the video clips and I've created an organized folder system um, in my local drive. Um, so pay attention to where your teacher tells you to save your work. I've made uh, a folder called footage, uh, music, um, project uh, folder, which will become apparent when I open Premiere Pro and a sound effects um, file as well. So I'm going to open up Adobe Premiere Pro and I'm going to start a new project. Uh, make sure you browse the location and find uh, the files that you've just created and save it to the project file that you've just um, project folder sorry that you've just created so go to select folder and hit OK. Okay, so now you're greeted with this screen. Uh, you need to import your media to start. So I'm going to double click here. Again, point it to where your footage is. So I'm going to double tap footage. Now I want all of these clips and I'm going to hit open. Wait for those files to import. Now you can change your file view. So even though we know we just want the audio from these files, you might there might be a visual indicator there to uh, indicate which uh, clip you want. So if I click and drag this clip into this window, hit play. Oi well, lads, is that Lloyd? Haven't seen him in a bit. Yeah. Okay, so there's two ways of doing this. If you want um, the first part of the audio, so um, grab the marker to the beginning part, Let's play. Lloyd, haven't seen him in a bit. Yeah, the name. Well, press, press, pause. Pause. press the in point. Press spacebar. Lloyd, haven't seen him in a bit. Okay, you press the uh, out point. So it's um, I on the keyboard and on the keyboard. And there's two symbols here: one for video and one for you see it says drag audio only. You click on the mouse and you drag it to your timeline and you will just be the audio on the timeline there. So essentially this window uh, replicates what's in your um, library and this window, uh, well this instance is not showing anything, but it will play what's on your timeline so you can play it back. Zan Lloyd, haven't seen him in a bit. Okay, so what happens if you accidentally drag from this window and you mistakenly um, have um, both audio and video connected. Well, essentially you right click and then you unlink and then making sure you're on the selection tool, select the top layer and hit backspace or delete on your keyboard and then you will have removed, uh, the video. Because essentially for this podcast task, you just want um, the audio clips. Okay.